Hi, everybody. Welcome back to Pastor Kevin and Friends. And I am so glad that you could be with us today. It's me and Holy Cow. And, and uh, Holy Cow, say hello. Uh, holy Cow, you, you need to talk to the people. Holy Cow, what? Oh, huh. All right, holy cow, I'll show him. What do you for me? What do you say for me? I brought with me today a Hershey candy bar. Woo! A lot for your candy bar. Woo! Oh, so thank you. You got that for me. Who said it's for you? Who's got to make for me? Because you's on a diet. <laughs> well, yes, I am on a diet. And yes, I did buy this candy bar. And, uh... I did get it for you. Oh, you Kevin, you is so cool. You so nice. I love candy. Yes, I know you do. But holy cow, I want to remind you of a verse from the Bible. Oh no, the Bible's gonna take my candy bar away. No, 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 no. The Bible says in Psalm twenty four, verse one, the earth is the Lord and everything in it. You know, that ain't our candy bar. That's God's candy bar. Well, boy, you got a good question there, buddy. But let me show you something. You know, <clears throat> when you open these up, <laughs> I smell it, I smell it, I smell it. We have a great big candy bar. Now, unfortunately, ours has been broken in half. All right, ready? Well, it's still eatable. Well, yes, it is still eatable. But if you look, there are 12 squares of chocolate. Woo! One for every hour of the day. Well, okay, but holy cow, how did you get this candy bar? Well, you got it for me. Yes, but what did I have to do to get it? You went to the store, and you got your money out, and you paid the lady, and then you went out to the car, and you drove home, and you opened it, and now I was going to eat it! No, whoa, 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 slow down. So, um, can I have some of it? No, it's not candy bar. Well, wait a minute. You know, I just shared a verse with you. Oh, Psalm 24, 1, the earth is the Lord, and they are dying in it. You know, candy bar really, really bad. All right, I tell you what, I'm going to set it down, and I'm going to break it down. So now we have three of the 12 squares. Oh, is that looking good to me? But what if I just had one square? One square? Yes. Just one? Yes. Not the whole thing? Yes. Well, I guess. All right. So... This is one twelfth of the candy bar. Oh no! First you start telling me about Jesus and he's gonna take a candy bar, and now you're doing mathematics and you're torturing me. Who do you think created mathematics? Main teachers. No, no, no. God made math. Oh, okay. And anyway, this is just one little bit of the whole candy bar. And since I got you the candy bar, shouldn't I get this one little bit uh, so that you can say, thank you, Pastor Kevin, for getting the candy bar? Oh, you ain't give back to the one that gave it to me? That's exactly right. And at church, we receive an offering in the church to give back to God because everything that we have comes from God, and he allows us to enjoy it. Look, I was going to enjoy the rest of that candy door. Yes, and by you enjoying the rest of it, and me just having this little taste, helps me on my diet. Well, I was going to help you any way I can. And I thank you. And when we give back to God through the offering, we're saying thank you, God, for providing everything that we have. Thank you, God, for providing me with Pastor Kevin, because otherwise I'd just be a stuffed animal on the shelf. Well, that's true. So, holy cow, let's remember to give back to God because he's given so much to us. Well, that's good news. I've got one more thing to give. A big white kiss to all the pretty girls. No. How about if you just give them a goodbye, holy cow? Alrighty, goodbye, holy cow. You don't take care and dust your hair. See you later, alligator. After a while, crocodile. Well, you don't brush your teeth. You only got to brush the ones you want to take. See ya. Bye-bye.